you've had an opportunity to uh, speak at length with both uh, leaders, uh, uh, President Salva Kiir and uh, Vice President uh, Riyak Macha. Yeah, what makes them stand out or be the leaders that uh, we are talking about today? Well, first of all, President uh, Salva Kiir, uh, Mayadit, he's obviously a man that uh, started out very early in his young career as a member of the Sudanese Armed Forces. Even though some people now will tell you he has since, in fact, uh, moved from being a victim, perhaps to becoming an oppressor himself. Quite revolutionary. <laughs> <laughs> We're revolutionary. <laughs> but obviously, he has a lot of expertise uh, in the area in which he has spent a majority, you know, part of his life, which is the military. So he must really be an expert, for example, on things like field craft. If he were to write a book, yeah. uh, I'm sure it would probably be a classic. Uh, because he would obviously take us through the journey uh, that brought him where he was as a young man to a current general who also happens to be president of his country. Uh, on the other hand, you have uh, Dr. Ria Kamachar. He becomes a doctor precisely because he actually did uh, a doctor of philosophy uh, in the United Kingdom. This is a man, as soon as he got his PhD in 1984, he actually went to the bush. Because he said he had to fight so that he could liberate his people. His people, he felt, were actually being, uh, frankly, treated as slaves. They did not have any rights that a citizen, you know, ought to have. They were subjects mm -hmm. of the dictatorship in Khartoum. He is the type of guy that uh, uh, exudes the diplomacy. And so he's the type of guy, frankly, that you don't mind doing business with him. Mm -hmm.